what did you gain from YouTube and how did you transition into using BeatStars? Yeah, like you, YouTube, the, the algorithm is like, like if you post a beat that day and then you just post like every day, like you're, you're guaranteed probably like at least a hundred views, even if you have nothing, you know, when it, when it pops up in that recommended. So YouTube, I was doing it like just in the description, hit my email, hit my Instagram, whatever you can buy a beat. And then I thought, okay, like this is a lot of, so somebody sends me an email at, at 1 PM and I'm busy and I don't respond till five. They might not even want that beat anymore or they might not answer me. So I'm getting my hopes up thinking there's going to be a sale. Uh, and, and they're, they're not into it anymore. Cause I gave them too much time or I didn't answer well. So like when I, and people have, have said to me, like, get on beat stars, get on beat stars. And I thought, oh, well, like may, maybe I don't need it. Maybe I want to be different. I had that kind of hubris where it's like, oh, like I got to do my own thing. Uh, as soon as I made that switch, probably halfway through, uh, 2019, it just made the process so much better. Cause instead of getting an email saying, Hey, I want to buy a beat, I'm getting an email saying they bought the beat. And, and that like from there, I was just hooked. I'm like, BeatStars is the future. BeatStars is where I need to be. Uh, I loved having my own website. You know, I can just put it on my, on my, my social. People can click it and they can get instant download. Like it's done wonders for me. Unreal. Sorry, I had to unmute myself. Yeah, I, th I think that's a pretty, I think you're the first person who's laid it out that way is just, I mean, everybody talks about the quickness of BeatStars and the efficiency, but I think the comments of of literally getting an email where it's like oh my god I, I just made this sale but there's an artist out there that has it I don't have to worry about doing all this back end admin I think that's pretty incredible and and helpful so let's talk about um when you made the shift to beat stars how did you start growing your fan base or your following on there did you were you able to shift your followers from YouTube over or was it reconnecting or sorry connecting with new people like up until this year um I was literally like, I'm never, I've never been big on the self promo. I've never been like, Hey, like, go listen to this, go listen to that. And like, I, I wasn't even really on social media that much when I, when I started. So I was just lucky enough to, to have the algorithms working for me. And if I was uploading 20, 25 beats a month, you know, they, they were getting heard. So the fan base just kind of grew through consistent uploading of content. But now that it's, it's 2021, uh, I'm on the Instagram, I'm, I'm interacting, I'm, I'm following people back. I'm realizing how, it can take what I'm already doing with the consistent uploading and just, and just blow it up. And everybody loves to be affiliated with somebody that, that shows an interest in their stuff. So when you're not ignoring and like not following people and stuff like that, you know, it, you can do okay. You don't need to, you don't need to be in everybody's face, but when you show love back, you know, you create a fan for life. Like you hundred percent create a fan for life when you, when you show love back. So what, what are some of your ways of, of showing love back? Oh, like collabing with people, you know, just commenting on them, you know, if they want to FaceTime, say what's up, just try to reply to messages and stuff. It can be tough when you have when you have a lot and then you're trying to prioritize, okay, like, these are my collabs that I'm sending out. This is who I'm working with. This is my upload today. Um, so I apologize to anybody if I'm not replying fast enough, but like, I really do love all the love and I love showing love back. So just always answering, always trying to know, give people positive feedback, you know, do a beat together, whatever it's got to, whatever it's got to be.